Hey guys, God is not disappointed in you. Got a minute? This message is for the Christians. Whenever you make a mistake, God is not disappointed in you. God loved you when you were head over heels in sin. Now that you are trying to live righteously, now that you're trying to go after his heart, do you think that he is less patient with you? He's less loving towards you? He's less caring? No, he still loves you the same, and you don't disappoint him. If we look in the book of Genesis, we see the story of Abraham and Sarah. Whenever they were well past their age where they could have children, God shows up and says, now I'm going to fulfill the promise. And Sarah laughs. God calls her out, says that she laughed. She says she didn't. And they end up naming their son that they have later laughter. This is a great story. It's exactly the way that it's read. But if you read the way that God recounts this story in the book of Hebrews, it sounds a little bit different. And by faith, even Sarah, who was past childbearing age, was enabled to bear children because she considered him faithful who had made the promise. This sounds like a completely different story. She laughed. She thought this was a funny joke, that this was a lie, that this wasn't going to happen. She gave up on it. But that's not how God remembers it. God said that she bore a child by faith because she believed in him who made the promise. God doesn't focus on our mistakes. Whenever we make a mistake, it is his loving kindness that brings us back to him. No matter what you've done, no matter what hidden sin, no matter what there is under the surface, God loves you. He's not disappointed in you. He is waiting for you to turn towards him and he can forgive you and love you and bring you up into his embrace. Thanks for taking a minute.